Hey, we're Secret Agent Agency, and we are continuing to play the cat game. My name is Kevin, and joining me, I got an Andrew. Hello. Time to be cats. Uh, I think, what was the, um, how long to beat was like four hours or something? I yeah, I, I don't know how long it was going to take, but... Yeah, four and a half. Main story. I didn't really keep track of how much dicking around I was doing, but... Okay, okay. Oh, I have to press A for each individual step. Love it. Yes. Yes. Not sure. I'm gonna meet this guy. I'm sorry, I... I need a moment. I don't feel like talking right now. Oh yeah, B12 is sad because he realized that he was... He is the scientist. And he, like, I guess made himself into a robot somehow. Oh! <laughs> yes! Do I get pain on my little toesies? Uh, doesn't look like it. It's all Always dry. Kind of just paint anywhere, any anyway, everywhere. Oh, do I have to like jump up here first? Oh, okay, up here. No. Uh. Oh, Please. I can't. Oh, right, because he doesn't want to talk. Yeah. I'll just meow. I can't meet any robots because. B12 doesn't want to talk. Okay, I'm putting it all together now. Uh, yeah, take take purple plant. Am I not allowed to take objects because he doesn't? I guess not. Okay, I guess I guess there's a story thing I gotta do. Progress the plot. Progress the plot. I just remembered there's a meow button. Yep. You already got the achievement for that. What? What else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends. What happened to everyone? I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to save? Well, he's floating around again. That's good. Ooh. Oh, yes! What is this? Oh, it's the Balthazar! Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during his transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Mama when we received that call earlier. I'm glad to meet you at last, little outsider. You know Momo and Doc, so you're already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings me peace. Momo stayed in the slums. I heard you helped find Doc and Clementine. She's in Midtown now. If you still want to see the outside, she's the one who can get you there. Apparently, she had some kind of plan to leave the city. Here, take this. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. To reach Midtown, climb up our little village. It should be easy for a dexterous one like you. If you manage to meet, reach the outside, you will be the very first. I'd wish you good luck, but you don't need it. I believe in you. I'm sorry for shutting down earlier. I'm human, probably the last in the world. Now look what's left of me. So much has come back to me. How much have I forgotten? Maybe if we find Clementine, we can restore my memories and get you back home at the same time. We can go back 
down and find out more from the companions or head onward to Midtown. Let's talk this about the czar again. Oh, okay. Oh, show item. Okay, cool. Uh, let's head back down and meet everybody now that uh, B12 is feeling hopeful. I collect that flower. Uh, yeah. Person. The soothing sound of trash falling, shimmering waterfalls, no dangers. It's a blissful place to work on my poetry. Here, listen. The mighty concrete, shielding me in its womb. Shall you also be my tomb? You think it's too solemn? I mewed in response. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's meet them first. <laughs> 9,536 games, 1 to 6. Don't tell anybody, I'm actually programmed to win this game. Hmm. Statistically, I should have won at least 8 times. Alright, let's fuck them up. Did you know there were more than 900 shades of white paint? Don't tell anyone, but I'm creating my own shade of paint. I'm calling it Garbage Brown. I love Garbage Brown. Mm -hmm. There's more than May one is white. in her... Oh, hi! Hey! I'm gonna turn me headphones up. May is in her destructivist period, so she says. I'm sure she'll become a great artist. If only she could practice elsewhere. Oh, that kind of period. I thought it was a different kind of period. No. No. <laughs> I do I love the smell of fresh paint. <laughs> it reminds me of... Oh, wait. I can't smell anything. How sad. It's not a face, Mom. How you doing, Jihoon? I I literally just got back from work. <laughs> nice. Although in the near future, I don't think I can afford to do this or show up at this time at least. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's no problem. Did you rush back here on my account? Yes. Damn. <laughs> you didn't have to. All right, we grabbed purple. Oh, maybe I could show it to the uh, the artist here. No, not interested in what I got. Uh, haven't talked to this guy. Electric everywhere. Whatever the electricity sound I'm making. <laughs> Oh, hello there. It has been so long since we had a visitor. Well, except those damn Zerks, of course. Imagine if we could harness their power, having them run in a wheel or something. Such waste of potential. When I grow up, I want to be great like Aunt Clementine. I want to explore like she did, but the grown-ups forbade us to leave Ant Village. Okay, I went in a big circle. What's our current objective? Um, basically climb to the top, but also we have the option of kind of meeting all these people and finding out other info. Fuck it. It's a pulley system. Let's talk first. This food is actually horrible, but it's the only thing around. I'll have to unscrew my front casing if I keep eating this trash. 
Sorry? People call me the Tin Chef. I specialize in upcycling leftovers. Today's special, Ramen J45, with my secret ingredient. Terrifying. Oh, yellow plant. Okay, we got purple and yellow. Oh, shit, where do you... I forgot where the position at the color wheel. Oh, uh, they're not... Oh, they're actually yellow and purple. And like, they're opposite of each other. Yeah. All right, bucket time. Oh, this was a mistake. Oh wait, no, this is a new area. I haven't been on a swing yet. Let's see, I can nap here. I don't know if there's a Chivo for napping. Yeah, I found out there's an achievement for snuggling up to five robots. I've only found one that I can do that to so far, I think. Okay. Let's go more up. Oh. I guess... Oh, over here. Hello, buddy. How are you? Did you know that Aunt Clementine taught us to how to grow special plants that live without sunlight? I have a huge collection of them. Do you want to see? It's still missing some colors, though. I'm missing a yellow plant, a red one, and yes, a purple plant. If only someone small and agile could get them for me. Well, got our quest. Oh, I heard it's a rare plant. Thank you. Could you find the other for me? Please, please, please. I love that color. Thanks, buddy. Did you find the other for me? Please, please. Okay, we gotta find red. Hey. I'm bored. And Clementine used the whole classes here. We learned a lot of cool stuff. Uh, let's do bucket again. Where's this bucket take us? Oh. Not a very good bucket. I guess it's just like a fast way to get down. Still looking for a color or did you get, it, you get them all? I'm uh, missing red. <laughs> oh. Heck. Heck in. Onwards and upwards. Oh, hold on. Perfect. Making a mess of everything. I'm a cat. I'm making my meowster piece.
<laughs> we have we lost our thing that kills the head crabs, right? Yeah. Yes. Give us power and take it away. Look, this is a subway station. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation existed. You could ride to anywhere in the city. People used to take it to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning after saying goodbye to my family at home. I remember, I was doing this for them. They're gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see the outside. What? Does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? Anyway, we're near Medtown now. Let's find this Clementine. We have a picture of her. We can show it to some of the companions around here. Maybe they'll point us in the right direction. Why is this doing that? Ooh, it's lava underneath. Oh, is it, oh, it's when you touch it. So it's the LED yeah. light. Yeah. What's wrong with that? I mean, it was just weird. Oh. Yeah, it's it's fucking just... weird, Jihoon. Strange detail. Look, it's futuristic, okay? You step on the stone and it lights up as a warning. I think that's a very futuristic idea. It's not my, it's not their fault that you're not catching up their futuristic vision, you know? Don't worry about trash. Neko Corporation, copyright, takes care of everything. Oh, what? <laughs> Damn, what a cat like behavior. <laughs> Treating an uh, innocent bystander and no remorse for it. I already told you five times, Yosh. You can't run around like that, it's dangerous. It is the first time I've seen this kind of robot. You look so fluffy. Oh, it's the girl displayed on this wanted screen, right? You should ask somebody else. I'm too busy with yours here to know anything. Hey! Please state your identity. Cooperate or we will have to transfer you to jail and reboot you. Please leave me alone. I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine. I'm sure she's hiding in the residence. Access to lower level is restricted due to organic life hazards. Please keep out of this area. Oh, what's up, dude? Do you hear that down below? That ebb? That flow? The city haunts me. 
It taunts me. Ooh, Clementine? Yeah, I used to hang out with her, but she wanted to leave. She was a breeze, and then she flew. She's a wanted person now, and too heavy for me. Shh, you hear that? That ebb, that flow. Hey. Oh yeah, apparently the robotic language has been translated by fans. Oh. Midtown. It's like an Albed equivalent. Like, yeah, it's actually a full fledged <laughs> language. I guess, yeah. Cool. Hmm. Consider this. Tomorrow, if I replace my arm with another robotic arm, and then the next day, my other arm too, and then my body, and so on, until I've replaced all of my parts and upgraded my software. Will I be the same robot you were talking to now? Okay. So he's got a fucking Theseus's ship dilemma. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey. What are you showing me right now? A bunch of people I don't know. My guess is they probably live in the massive housing building further uptown. Also, hi, Mel. How you doing? That was probably a while ago you said that. My apologies. Yes. <laughs> oh. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what did that robot do to you, man? Why you gotta pull the innocent robot? <laughs> oh my. Cut that out. <laughs> This merchant crook sold me a faulty battery the other day. Now he just pretends not to hear me every time I try to confront him. If it wasn't for the sentinels on patrol, he'd end up in spare parts. <laughs> and yes, yes, I can keep doing it. Okay, this is where I get my nuzzles in. I'm gonna nuzzle with every fucking robot. That's say made in France? Hold on. Yep. France exists in this universe, confirmed. Well, yeah, this is like the far, far future. Yeah, I assume this is just like Earth, but everyone's dead. I think everyone's dead. There's a living cat being in control of. Yeah. Clubs closed. Get lost. Oh yeah? Who are you? Police? Everyone's looking for her. I didn't let her in if that's what you want to know. You just asked if a cat is police. Although, I do want to play a game where I play as a police cat. I have oh. played a game where I play as a police dog, technically. Yeah. Which one? Tail Concerto. Oh, you're. Oh, speaking of um, the uh, the tank game from the same studio, it's their Steam version has been released originally Ooh. for Nintendo. I'll have to check that out. Let me double check. You've been in the city of. below. I had a friend there, Fifi. I haven't seen him in ages. All right, cool, Albert. He's got a traffic cone on his head.
Someone drew a cat here. Somebody here has seen a cat before. Oh yeah, the title is Fuga Melodies of Steel. It's on Steam okay. now. Like, as of recently? It was released like a couple days ago. Like, uh, Damn. July 28th. Yeah, that's like, what, how many days is it? One. Like, just like a couple days ago, yeah. Like three, yeah, four days ago. Okay. I tried downloading an aimbot to be the best at this game, but ended up with a malware. I'm not sure why, but everyone seems odd now. Nice picture! I've seen this girl before, I think. She was looking for information about all sorts of very old machines. Weird. Oops. Hey! I've mastered every game that ever existed, but I can't figure out how this one works. Am I not seeing the whole picture here? I've seen this girl before, I think. She was... Okay, same. Same text. Dude, it's pool and you're a robot. Like, you should... You should just be able to just fucking win pool. Well, some of them are programmed differently. Remember the ones playing, um, was it, um, Sudoku? Mahjong. Mahjong. Also, holy shit, Andrew. <laughs> what? I know the names of games. I don't know, Tonin. Like, pretty much every- I like pretty much everything. Nice pic- okay. Nice picture. Hey! What will it be today, little sir? <laughs> Our world must seem gigantic from your little eyes. Wish I could be as tiny as you, so I could explore new, hidden places. She lives in the residency, doesn't she? Okay. My favorite drink is oil. What's yours, Mimus? Me. <laughs> oh, can't talk to this guy. He's just enjoying his oil. He was knocking it on the ground. That's right. I'm an idiot cat. Can I knock over the bonsai? I can't get up here. I can't knock over the bonsai. Uh, nothing to do here. Okay. I talk to these people? No. Love the blanket. Isn't it so cool right now? So chill. I think that nothing bad could happen to us. Oh yeah, I know her. I used to see her a lot. I think she lives around here. She was always talking about leaving the city. I don't get it. This place is great. Why leave? I used to own a bar. It was the coziest place around here. Until I took a screwdriver in the knee. And it's closed now. <laughs> oh, Great. I was expecting that. <laughs> yeah. Even if this guy bums me out, he's my only customer. Try not to scare him away, please. Well, it's now my life's mission to freak this guy out. Challenge accepted. What's the lie from the Simpson? Please, ma'am. He's, he's sending my children to college. <laughs> oh, I'm back at Conehead. Okay. Did I just miss those guys last time? Let's see, that's the bar. If you're cold net, are you powerful enough to fight against Pyramid Head? Ooh, probably not. Hmm. 
Queen James was able to take on how many? Three of them? <laughs> hey! Sorry, shop's closed. I'm waiting for a delivery, guys, but it seems like they're taking their sweet time. Hmm? What's that picture? Oh, I know her. She's one of those people who's all obsessed with the outside. Is that kind of what, like, you saw at the opening of the game? The outside? Yeah. Probably. Yep. It's the trendiest shop in Midtown, but the shopkeeper's pretty grumpy. What a nice looking picture. Is that an address on the back? Yeah, that first symbol is a street. And then there's a floor and a door number. Should be pretty easy to find. Are you one of those young punks listening to loud music all day? No, I'm a fucking cat. Don't touch anything. Don't make any noise. Don't ask for a credit. Who is that? Their clothes look terrible. Send them to me if they want to look fashionable. Dude, you are naked except for a fucking, like, bomber jacket. No thanks. It's not a look. Oh, shit. It's look. Okay, hold on. We're doing that on our way out, I think. Oh my god, why are you peeking inside? You pervert! Respect the privacy. <laughs> no, no, you're not gonna steal that. Uh, I'm guessing I have to, like, knock something over to cause a distraction. Like... This? Oh. What can I do from up here? Oh, oh, I probably have to play loud music. That makes sense. He was whining about that. Gotta find a cassette or a, a CD, maybe. Ooh. Did you ever make your own mixtape? I made a mixtape before. Do not proceed further. The, ac the access to the outside is fully restricted and the <laughs> elevator has been disabled. The exterior is unsafe. Do not proceed further. Yes. I just walked near the elevator and I got yelled at by the sentinels. For years we've been told that the surface is uninhabitable, but we just accept this as fact. But why? Why? Nuzzle nuzzle. You know what, my friend? Stay away from the Sentinels. They're vicious, and they got my buddy Pablo. No, Pablo. He's in for 350 years, so be careful. Oh, Clementine. If I were you, I would not want to find this girl. It's only a matter of time before she gets caught by the Sentinels. But keep asking around, and you'll end up finding her. Just know you will also find trouble. Prepare for trouble. <laughs> Oh, 
wait, make it double. Shit, it's been ages. Did, did you double. say prepare for double? Yeah, I did say that. That's funny. What can I do for you tonight, Chef? Can't you pay me with real money? What was that thing? Can I, can I find some money to get food? You can pay with the Bitcoin. Bitcoin, it, except you got another here. vendor yet? No. Get a vendor in the other area. Uh, I was on the Reddit for like a quick second, but there was apparently there was a restaurant in Long Beach, California that was actually accepting cryptocurrency as a to pay the food. Put the rent on Uh I just zoom out until you finally click a button. Yeah, how how far does this go? achievement for leaving the sitting for several hours i think that is a thing like sleeping for an hour that might be this right here been here? No. Hey. Ouch. Huh. What's that weird feeling? Oh. oh. I think... I, okay. You know, work is work, Slippy. Don't lose your head about it. Oh yeah, Clementine. She went here once. Why do you ask? You have her address on the back. The residence is just to the right when you leave my shop. Ah, there you go. Good instructions. Instruction not clear. I, cu I cut the whole head. Wait, wait. I saw... Oh, was it the talk to that guy? Probably. Surgery. I want surgery. He's still there, guarding that one vest. Yeah, I yeah, gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta find music. Have I been here? Oh yeah, I think I have. This place is very dense.
I'm also looking for the residence, which should be here, I would think. Oh, maybe I have to climb. I'm a cat. Yes, you are. Can I go in this window? No. All right, go from here. Up here. Ah, ah, ooh. Let me in! I don't know what the downstairs neighbors are up to. I keep hearing buzzsaw and hammer noises. Ooh. Hammering. I'm sure they're fixing their furniture. Oh, it's a surgery room, right. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, these are robots. <laughs> oh, have I been here? Ooh, I haven't been here. I'm busy. What do you want? Go away. I have a quick growing up question. What okay. Happened? Oh, boy. Did you... I'm ready. Did you... Did your job offer a 401k? Yes. Did you say yes or no? I said yes. Okay. No, because it's, you know, even some people, like, even the job offer said they say no. Because, like, I don't know, I feel like 401k is not something you should just blindly say yes to. Oh, well, I definitely right. blindly said yes to it. Yeah. Is the same for you as well, Andrew? What's that? Did you say yes to 401k? What a question. So, I set mine up as um, like a Roth IRA fund. And apparently I was mistaken. They matched me like 15% or something crazy. I thought it was way less than that. Oh. That is a 15%. So, like by year end, by maxing it, I'm, I'm getting like a couple extra paychecks effectively. Just wow. That... That much power. Works pretty good, though I can't touch it until I'm 60. Huzzah! Yeah, I guess that's the downfall, isn't it? <laughs> Wait, doesn't it? Well, I could, but I get heavily, like, dinged on it for doing something stupid like that. Well, you can only have 401k as long as you're employed, right? Uh, no, it's just like it's. I have it. Oh, sorry, I. I got also, it's um, through the okay. government, so it's called Thrift Savings Plan, TSP, not a. Um, or uh, okay, whatever, but it's. Oh, because I. Oh, uh, it's because I had this one. Um, I, might, I, had the, I had my own ex experience with it, as in. Um, you know, I got laid off because of COVID. And then. It was even though it was an internship, it was a paid internship. So they uh, they gave me a four hundred one k account, but because I was laid off, I was no longer I couldn't invest into four hundred one k. So they and since the amount was so low, they straight up gave it the 
the investment company say, "Hey, you got too, too, your money is too low. We'll just give it back to you." I mean, that was my I, case. I mean, with my uh, previous job, I was there eight years, so I just had it um, transferred. It was like a transfer IRA rollover or something to the same <laughs> outfit that's um, got most of my money. Okay, that's good to know. Okay. I've been doing it that way. I didn't get like text on the transfer. Oh, that'd be weird if you get taxed on the transfer, yeah. Well, you get taxed on any earned income. So if it's like cashed out, that's income. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay, I just want to share pe more people's uh, opinion regarding 401k because I might get into it or not. We'll see in the near future. Well, my re recommendation is always doing the um, the Roth route, or you get taxed on what you put into it. So it's like it doesn't get reduced from like your total pay at year end or whatever. So you do have to pay a little more in taxes in the short term, but if you're presuming that you're going to come out ahead in the end, you make more money out of it. It doesn't get taxed when you uh, withdraw at all. Huh. There you go. So what are we looking for? What's our objective? We're Bye. looking for Clementine. Yes. Okay. Also a CD or some other kind of musical. Yeah. Is there any other like kind of like characters we saw that we find an item we can interact with them more? Um, we're still looking for a red flower. I don't know if that's like specifically back that there. That's probably yeah. That had to have been back there. We're like pretty far past that point now, right? I guess so. I uh, I think that that was actually number one complaint about this game is that. You cannot backtrack. So once you're out of the certain area, you're you're gone. I mean, whatever. It's like I'm not gonna say walking simulator because it's not, but kind of just like going through the flow. And the game's fairly short. Is there already speed runs? What's a speed run? So oh, it's, it's literally built in the achievement. Uh, 54 minutes. Oh, damn! <laughs> That's any percent. Yeah, no one's running 100%. The cat in those speedruns is just mad dashing to every location as fast as humanly possible. Mm-hmm. Very uncharacteristic. You gotta take naps here and there. <laughs> yeah, cats don't give a fuck. They, they take a nap when they feel like it. Would you agree with that statement, cat owner? Yeah! That's not give a fuck. Take naps. Take nap yep. whenever you want. There you go. You're the only cat expert among us, so you have to you have to answer among these us. kind of yes stuff. So you have to answer these kind of things right away, man. You're the cat expert. There's definitely a part of me that kind of wants to own both cat and dog, but. Uh, that's owning a pet is a whole different story. So be careful. I found where I'm supposed to be. Oh! Hey, dumb face, we can see you too. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, those tapes are ours. Don't you know not to steal? I could give you one, but you'll have to do something for Jinma, Miko, and me. The Sentinels have installed three security cameras to watch over us. We don't like that at all. Can you get them off our backs? And yeah, I can do that. Down. Life is boring since the Sentinels put cameras in our residence. Okay. Let's beat up these fucking cameras. Get our cassette tape and get our, um... Was it a reflective vest? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. I got a... I got a phishing text message claiming that uh, UPS, USPS at delivery. Sorry. It's like the message reads, we failed to deliver a parcel to, to unpaid delivery fees to re-deliver head over to the website and book a re-delivery. What the hell is the word parcel? Actually, it's like British people, that's what. Parcel? Parcel. Parcel. Or the country that's been colonized by the British Empire. Anyway. Apparently, the, yeah, um, apparently there's a email address to report this for, for the postal service called the United States Postal Inspection Services. Cool. Yeah, so that is what it's called. Yeah, so I just follow direction. Sent an email. Hey, it's just a phishing, phishing text mail, text message. I got. Will they do something about it? Who knows? I yeah. wish they do. What the fuck are you telling us? <laughs> this this well has done. been PSA. <laughs> yeah. I didn't think you could do it. Here, take your prize. You've earned it. Got a got a fucking cassette tape. Okay, I know exactly what to do with this. Oh god, Jack. Do you actually miss the cassette tape? Playing a cassette tape, you know, since? Not even a little bit. No. Because, you know, so, so many people are like, Man, you just had to trip that guy, didn't you? I just saw you doing it. Yeah. yeah. The same guy from earlier? No, different yeah, there's, guy. There's a few guys walking around. Look, I, I see so many people, like, having this nostalgia about, like, Oh my god, sick player, Sony Walkman, man. Once in a while, when I get into those, when the doing this topic I'm so now isn't there a difference with um like with records like with how it's played back or no oh, like the fidelity of the audio oh yeah definitely so that's an older format that still has like relevancy versus freaking tape I don't know which is actually more volatile between those two, like, cause tape, cassette tape, once, yeah. once those tapes I have no up, clue what to do with this jacket. How would they give it to somebody? I guess. I was hoping we'd wear it. Oh. Well, it's something relevant to this factory. Oh, 
We tried going past those like robots at the um No, I haven't tried yet. Point. Let's see what happens. There you go. Good. I am going to try the bar. Talk to a couple more people. That looks like a Walkman. That's cool. There's Bar. I don't know if you told <laughs> yeah. this story before, but are you taking your Steam Deck to work? Yeah. Okay. It was downtime, kind of hanging around. I was checking on something on Steam real quick and I saw your name with the Game Pass on it. Oh shit, he's playing on Steam Pad. But what time is it right now? Oh, is he playing at the work? <laughs> Me. So jealous. <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's all I. That's all I had to say. Hmm. Hmm. Very contemplative as he looks at this uh, reflective shirt. So, like a direction in this area that we haven't gone. What do you mean you forgot your character sheet? I spent the whole week preparing the session. I'm sorry, I forgot where I put it, but let's play anyway. I will go in that cave, let's go. 
Nice. I'll compel to enter the box. What's that noise? I oiled up all my bearings last month. What are you exactly? A quadruped making cute sounds? I like the concept. Okay, floor three and then door five. Oh, I wonder if there's anything if I examine. No. Let's show it to the robot. That's the jacket we stole in that shop. Okay, very helpful. Thank you. I told you everything you needed to know about it. What more must you know? Okay, here's door five. All right, let's meet Clementine. I thought you were a set. Never mind. Who are you? What do you want? I want jacket. Nice jacket. <laughs> Wait, so Zabaltazar finally decided to send someone? I guess you're my new recruit. You're not very big. How'd you even manage the sewers? I guess he must be pretty resourceful. I've been looking for a way to the outside ever left ever since I left in village, but the Sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help. Follow me. <laughs> I've been working on a plan to use this old subway for a while now. I even have the keys to start it. All we need is an atomic battery to power it. Oh boy. I know Neko Corporation has one secured inside their factory. I have a contact who can help us infiltrate them. I don't know his name. He's a robot with a bomber jacket and a gold chain. Make this message to him. Someone small and swift like you should have no trouble sneaking inside the factory. One last thing. Don't hesitate to ask around for help. This city is full of information. Just stay clear of the Sentinels. I didn't expect Clementine to look so normal. I mean, what were you expecting? Like some 
conspiracy theories outfit like, or something like Zabalt that? Zabalthazar was just like kind of looked like he was dead. Uh, oh. Doc had a unique look. Momo had kind of a unique look. I don't know. Oh. The second time that I heard Clementine as a name of the character, the other one being the. Shit, what was the name of the zombie game? Walking Dead. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, I guess I'll just fucking uh, leave. <laughs> okay, so I guess I need the jacket to do something in the factory. All oh, right, we're looking for somebody in a bomber jacket and a gold chain. I have a feeling it's a bouncer. No chain. I'll still talk to him anyway. Oh well. Oh, the, uh, the guy who's being held up here is gone. This is the guy. Blazer. Where did you get that? Oh, you're with the uh, my contacts? Let me brief you about the atomic battery. The battery is powering the Necocorp factory right there, but this whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. They they check every person who enters and turn away anyone who is not a worker. Here's an idea. Get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here to check for a good time to enter. Okay, so I need a helmet. Yeah, Got the jacket. Uh, I guess I should... So one of those. Do you have any leads on the helmet? Let me just kind of uh, like nothing I can think of. Um, there's the sleeping guy. <sighs> Trying to remember where he was. Oh. Oh, 
Okay, this has got to be it. We got to find a way in that place. Oh, let's meet this guy. I've been waiting for ages for Stuplichi to get back and help me restock these hats. The boss is not happy. If that guy's slacking off at the bar again, he's got another thing. Okay. So, I, I understand what must be done. Bar. Right? No, this isn't it. Hold on. But you've been zipping around this area. I don't think I could even attempt to help mm -hmm. direct you anywhere. Yeah, for anybody who might be new uh, to the channel, um, I'm really bad at finding my way around stuff. So who has the helmet here? So we're just trying to find somebody who is slacking off. Uh, I don't know which one of the- Let's start chatting up everybody. Oh, guy in back room. This- yeah, this is new. Uh-huh. Well, here we go. It kind of had to commit to that. I'm just a stupid cat. Stupid cat. I thought we were a good dolphin. Making too much racket. This is just like Goose Game, by the way. <laughs> That's the one. Yoink. And I'm gonna scratch the carpet, because I'm a cat. Anything else I can do while I'm here? Okay. Alright, I'm a worker cat now. Right now. I'll get dressed now. Mind turning around? These are great. A little snug around the waistline, but it will do. Oh my god. I just spilled some beer. 
Upsies. Upsies. Hopefully that'll do. Okay. These are great. A little snug around the waistline, but it'll do. Okay, hop in this box. I'll sneak you across the checkpoint. I'm gonna move this over here. Yeah. Still getting used to new desk. Meow button doesn't do anything. No. I can give you stuff up. Meow. Guess I'm just good to jump out. Okay. So this is the forced stealth part of the game, I guess. Plenty of boxes for us to find. Wouldn't be uh, a true stealth action game without boxes. Oh, you didn't see me? Yay! There was like this, there's like those little small shadows that kind of get. Hey, good thing you're here. You can help me. I lost the keys to my place in this dark and huge factory. The Sentinels refused to help me. They told me, if no place to go, more work here. If by any chance you could help me find them, I'll be eternally grateful. I can find some keys. Dead.
That was really mean. So violent, all of a sudden. Now I know what the rules are, I'm a bit more, uh... Was it, was it past that? This is interesting. Oh, do I have to be like under the box? Well, this does work. I get barrel over there. Okay, roll it. So I need another thing to weight down that. Maybe I get it from climbing. Or locking the room. Oh, wait, wait. Each one does like a different thing.
the, the only interactable movable thing. Oh, can I use this? Jump up high. Oh. Oh. Well, you okay. Know, you gotta put it up. We got it! Quick, let's get out of here before the Sentinels show up. We gotta get this battery back to Clementine. We're here! We have jailbreak. Okay. Uh, it's gotta be a bucket. Let's go! Bucket time! Yes! That was easy. I'm not prepared for cats. Oh, things are happening. Uh, gotta find another way back there. Let's talk to our pals. Miko! You can steal our spot, but you can't steal our moves! Nothing makes sense if we can't dance. Hey, you think you can stop us from hanging in our digs? Oh shit, hold on. Hold on. Oh, it's like vibrating a place for a second. I call this traffic cone skip. He's starting to levitate. like knock him out of bounds that's what i'm trying to do <laughs> i'm trying to get him to hop the fence i'm gonna arrest him if he does that holy shit <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna try to get the uh the uh Boombox guy over here. And I get the cone over this lip. Oh no. Wait, this might be better. Ah, uh, yes! There's gotta be some nefarious thing I can do with this cone. Okay, whatever. Don't you appreciate having thumbs? <laughs> it's able to not just have to use your face to move shit like that. Anyway, I'm a cat. Oh, shit.
Yeah. Okay, not that way. This way seems more doable. Uh... Oh, what? No, I'm a box. Didn't see this. <laughs> Stop meowing. <laughs> You've gathered them all. <laughs> this game is wonderful. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, so I think I'm supposed to draw them out, maybe? Or maybe not. Uh, you got a box uh, in there? Ooh, perfect. You just looking that way? Cool. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fuck. And the BP. Alright, where is friend? Clem? Hmm. No sign of Clementine. Oh, what's that? It looks like some kind of a coded message. We're going to have to play detective to figure out what happened to her. Look! For B12 and the cat, the answer lies in my stuff. And then there's four symbols. It's signed Clementine. Take a look. Okay, we got a plant, a crystal, a cone, and a lava lamp. Plant, crystal... It's in that one, two, three, four. Well, lava lamp's right there. That's a rock. Plant. Plant, 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 plant. something? Hmm.
Everything else is really obvious, but like I can't find the first thing. Plant? Yeah. Like I can't find the one I'm supposed to interact with. Kind of pull up my menu and take a look. Oh, is it the, um... Oh! It's the thingy by the, the, the hookah area. Okay. Right. You gotta open it. My sensors can only detect harmless chemicals in a gaseous state. They create- they can't recreate the calming sensation I remember. Like me, companions can't smell, so I wonder why they do this. There's also a message hidden under the container. It says, I'm with... Okay. Cool. Thanks, man. You're so powerful. Rock. This gem is a medium value and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Maybe it acts as a beacon for us to find something useful? Bingo! There's a message. It says, Blazer. I'm with Blazer. Huh? What an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this the way companions here see humans? It's kind of funny. Look, something's been left here. It says, come to. And lava lamp. It's a couple of these. I thought there was one up here. It's somewhere else. Uh... Where was the other lava lamp? I know there were two. Oh, that's it. Maybe it's the one at the computer after all? Let's look. Must be a special one. We just have lava lamp left. Yeah. Well, I don't think anything's been like super hidden. Oh, was that up above the stove? Oh my god. Dude, you're so good at this. Fuck. I have no idea what this is, but this glow is kind of mesmerizing. Sorry, I was elsewhere. I didn't even notice this message here. It reads, Nightclub. 
Okay. Have fun. I'm a blazer. Come to nightclub. That's it. Well done, Lieutenant Cat. Meow. Now let's go find her. We don't have much time. <laughs> there they are. I hate this club. It's full of posers, but at least there's no sentinels there. Oh, I can rub on his leg. Achievement unlocked. Cat's best friend. Danger. Groove levels at 2%. Please find a dancing spot immediately. I don't think the bouncer's gonna let us in. Hey guys, I think we're gonna have to climb at the back again. Hey. Uh, Okay, how climb this? Here? No. Oh, these boxes are all set up. <laughs> Hello, I don't have anything in your size. Sorry. What do you think, guys? Have you seen anything I haven't? Uh, Jihan's been gone for a while. Oh. Uh, let's get us climb up a lot. I feel like there's like lots of what appear to be awnings and shit that you can jump to potentially.
Like, is this like a dead end path? That's how it seems to me. You now to get to the backside of the club or whatever? Oh, wait a sec. I think this guy's here is a hint. Hey! Howdy, partner. Why don't you come over here so I can get a good look at you? Okay, yeah, it's probably a big hint. <sighs> Wonderful! Look at this little cutie! Yeah, <laughs> that's, uh, that's a big hint. Okay. Incredible. Hey! Hey, how'd you get up here? You wanna party with us? Here, jump in and go get a drink! Amazing! Easy. You like my mask? I made it myself. It jams the sentinel scans and it looks cool. Oh, he's like a fucking dragon. I'll hopefully get like a wireframe hat for ourselves too. Give it to the left, give it to the right. It's called the beep boop sweep swoop. It's called the z z z zegima dance. Okay. Hey. Isn't this guy supposed to be like Dead Mouse? Hey everybody, DJ Matt C here. Let's get the party started. First song has been re requested by our very questionable friend Blazer. Ooh. Okay, we gotta get up on the balcony. I beg your fucking pardon. Oh, um, see ya. Remember. Cool, dude. These memories are optional, right? I assume. Or is it gonna be like a um like a little post game little thing, like in Breath of the Wild, getting them all. I yeah, I'm guessing it unlocks some other ending. Oh, take strange drink. What can I do with strange drink? Pocket it. Enjoying yourself, little one? Oh, you're not gonna drink that little cat? I don't think it's good for you. Oh, this guy's holding the lever. Okay. This club sucks. When I tried to go to that stupid VIP room, they kicked me out. Me! Can you believe it? So I stole this lever just for kicks. You give me a drink, I'll give you a silly lever. 
I don't need it. I don't want to be caught with it. Ooh, thanks, my friend. Here you go, as promised. Meow. Yee-haw. Backstab. Gotta do it to both. Oh! They should be able to manipulate it. Be quick. Oh. One guy just cannot stop jamming. something else first. Wait, I can hop on the fucking... God ah. damn it. Well, sorry for steering you wrong, because there's like that button prompt on the... record. DJ Meow Mix. Okay, which one do you think I press first? Uh, middle left, right. Okay, so this is not get me enough on its own. Okay, that's... Damn, I think that's it. Oh, middle left, right, middle. Cool. Let's 
this whole sequence is suddenly reminding me of um, the opening to Persona 5. <laughs> I can see that. I, I, I have played that. with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. Business is money. And I value money way more than friendship or camaraderie. They are all yours. I got an achievement, Alcatraz. Oh shit. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's that thing from Final Fantasy Nine. A bit easier than the Final Fantasy Nine one. I'm in jail. But I'm a cat. This should be easy. That guy looks like he's having a bad time. Oh shit. Oh no! in time. Oh, I just realized I don't I don't have my harness or B12. 
Yep. Okay, okay. Can we fit those grates? Nope. Uh, oh, these. Yes. Some of them have, like, the net and some don't. I don't know how true to life this game has been about if you can fit your head, fit the rest of your body through, like, <laughs> most cats. Keys! I can continue to meow in this hut scene. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. Oh shit. They're studying B12. <laughs> Jason! Jason! Sean! 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 <laughs> <laughs> Such a wonderful glitch. I love this whole teaming up with, like, a humanoid person to solve puzzles. This is cool. Oh, that's about to be a problem. Oh, uh, I get on the point. pipe. Okay. And then... This part's really difficult because I can't meow. You have to stop yourself from clicking a button. Yeah. Oh, 
shit. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> Oh, we just going to that center room? Lever. Oh, that's important. He's in trouble. Oh, they're on alert. Don't grab him, run! No! No! I bet your speed runs are like just screw stealth. Mm hmm. Oh, jeez. We got this. Behind you. The lasers. Oh, Lever. I mean, this will reset them. Backtrack all the way now. Are the lasers off? I felt like I was trapped in my lab's computer system again, all alone. But you came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. Meow. <laughs> so glad we're all together again, but we're not safe yet. We need to find a way out of here. Can you open that door just there? Yes, it turns out. Hey! Well, welcome that back, order? dude. This, uh, this is what happens when I when you play a peaceful game. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Finally, my role has been returned to me. The, I'm the I'm the guy who's supposed to fall asleep, not Andrew. Congrats! Yeah, you did it. I ever slept this morning. I actually, had my alarm wake me. Clever. 
Oh. Oh, there it was. The sentinels are blocking the way again. They will spot me instantly. Maybe you can try to bait them in their cells and lock them in? What is this guy over here? Hey! You see- Oh, it's Pablo! We heard about a Pablo who got caught. Do you see that guy in the ground over there? He was rebooted. I don't want to lose my memory. I'm so scared. This recovery center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear and lucid. I am an exemplary citizen now. Oh, that would close the door. Yeah, Hold up. In there. I gotta do what you were doing a, uh, a good shot of earlier. Get that thing's attention. Not that well, though. Oh, good enough. Hmm. Yeah, you don't need to perfect it, just good enough. <laughs> joining us <laughs> remember this poor fellow it seems the sentinels are ruthless when it comes to defying them that's what I feared they've completely erased him no more emotions no more self-awareness no more memories Please, let's not get caught. Hey! Hey, don't get me in trouble. I only have 758 years left and I'm free again. A bone. <laughs> okay, alright. Oh. <laughs> this is going to be tricky. They get one in there. And then that one looks like that one's that'll be quicker. Wait until it's no longer aggroed. So is that one sticking around for that one? That's what I mean. Yeah, it is. Oh, they're both out now. I figured it Ooh. out. Aha. Hey, you, what's your deal? Oh. 
Oh, okay. I missed my chance to talk. He's. Oh, no. Ah, ah, what? What are you did? That, that was funny. Lupin. Famous criminals, huh? Pablo Escobar, Lupin the Third, Al Capone. It's, his name and spelling always throws me off. It's like people call it Lupin, but it's I. It's French, isn't it? I mean, I know it's a Japanese anime, but the name would be French. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Which also throws me off. Threw, definitely threw me off the, uh... <clears throat> the protagonist persona in the Persona 5 is Arsula. I'm like, where is his name from? Or that is the other name for Lupin. Huh. Oh, Arsene? Arsene, yeah. Yeah, all their first personas in that game are famous, like, uh, criminals or whatever. AKA Phantom Thieves. This door. Yeah, it's the only way out of this jail. I think we can open it from that control room over there. We have to find a way to get access to that room, though. Let's look around. I'm a cat. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. So I remind you, I'm a cat. Ooh. <laughs> hey, this thing over here. We're in luck. They left the keys in the door. Hop on the back of the truck. You should be able to jump over the fence to access the secure area. This whole sequence is honestly just fucking amazing. I really enjoy this. Whoa! Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Kitty. Okay, bye. There's no way we'll make it with all the sentinels on our tail. I can distract them for a little while, but you have to go. The Outsider's Manifesto says, we must go outside at any cost. I wrote that. You're one of us now. It's not that everyone has to get to the outside, but one of us has to. Ain't subway key. Go. Now, I'll keep you in my RAM, little outsider. Wait, that's volatile memory! It'll get erased!
Arsene and Lupin was in fact made appearance in the Sherlock Holmes series. Ah. Wait, which Sherlock Holmes series? Uh, let's see. LeBlanc introduced Sherlock Holmes to Lupin in the short story Sherlock Holmes Arrives Too Late in Just Say Just Say Number 17. Is this the Benedix Sherlock? Like, what Sherlock's? There's been a lot of Sherlock media, is what I'm like saying. The series. Yes. There was. Oh, like in the books? Yeah. Okay. Were well, you thinking it was something like anime series or something? No, like one of the, like the, the dozen TV series. No, I'm talking about the actual original series, not TV series. Okay, cool. Uh, where put like keys? Bottom, keys? I can't remember who the hell was the uh, arch nemesis of Sherlock Holmes. Oh! Moriarty? Oh, thank you. James Moriarty. <laughs> mm. Kind of funny, like, I was actually expecting any character with the name were already in the uh, Persona 5, but never appeared. Where put keys? You still haven't looked at the end of the other track area. God damn it. Oh, battery! Yes, battery! Uh, excuse me, Parl Silk, thank you very much. They call it a battery. <laughs> I know. I can use the seat now. Oh, just try to use subway. Uh, Jade IPA from Foothills. And we got a day out tomorrow, and then you're like, you know what? Let's get, let's get wasted. <laughs> this stream is not sponsored by Jade IPA. <laughs> if you happen to watch the stream, please sponsor us. Kevin could use extra money. <laughs> I, I don't mind getting sponsored by beer. Okay, we made it to a different station. Is it actually a local brewery, though, or is it a big company? Uh, I mean, they make hopium. Let me see. Oh, Winston-Salem, North Carolina. There you go. So... <laughs> Less than an hour away from me is all I'll say. Yeah, I mean, I guess <laughs> that does count as a local. Oh, we're friends. Yeah. Hello. How may I help you? Please head to the leisure area if you would like to purchase or consume any goods. Have a nice day. Pick up the can. One thing I noticed right away is he seems like really clean and like taken care of. Oh, very clean, shiny. Mm. 
Greetings, inhabitants of Walled City 99. Greetings and salutations. I am currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. I just don't want paint. This is Wall City 99. Where's other than 8? Greetings, oh, inhabitants of Wall City 99. This door leading to the surface is currently locked due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. Hello, how may I help you? Hello, my current task is clean the window. Please refer to any certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Please have a nice day. I'm crazy how these little robots are like the actual machine robot, what the uh, inhabitant of the town is. Down there Hello. Like... The city has been sealed for your safety. Okay, here's the control room. There's our engineers. Okay. The control room is is closed by some sort of a security protocol. It says that only humans are authorized to enter. I see a problem here. It also says I'm not considered human. Hey, that's offensive security protocol. Maybe if we work together, we can open this passageway. Hmm. Work together. Oh. Get up. The fuck? Oh yeah, I forgot that you don't really have a, you don't actually have a jump, but... Maybe you have to roll something? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Nice. <laughs> uh, that's why you were sharpening your claws earlier. I'm a kitty cat. Kitty cat. This is a control room for the entire city. They controlled everything from here, and it's empty. I remember hating them so much. They had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. A little good it did them. The plague. I remember now. Everyone was dying and they thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. But I can still help you. We can still go outside. Together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. Okay, I think we're close to beating this. This is it, the main computer.
According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city is stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. We'll need to bring the rest of these systems online. These computers hold the data we need. We need to turn them on. Ew, gross. While you do that, I'll look for passwords and encrypted keys to get into the system. Okay. Gotta run around turning on computers. There's numbers and letter, uh, colors on that uh, board by him. Oh. Uh, okay. B12. Okay. B12 is the name of our pal. Oh. I was just saying what I saw show up on the screen for a second. Yeah, that's a very cat way of turning on the computer. Just hit the random keyboard. Oh, that's way easier than what I thought we might have to do. It's lights out. Hey, cat. It worked! Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. There. That's the workstation to open the city. But there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. Now we need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. Yes! What's a good target for my mayhem? Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, the terminal with a big fucking lock on it seems, uh, Pretty... Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So isn't B12 supposed to be interactive with it first, or...? Oh, here we go, here we go. Push. So that is that plugged into well. here. Oh. Yes. Oh, now we can hack. Yeah, that's hacking for sure. <laughs> Crossing the wires. The, 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 the system is taking more than I expected. Intrusion alert. Oh no, we've got to keep going. Attack that. Oh no. I, I can recharge them so you open that workstation. I don't like this. We might be leaving without our pal. No, why do robot pals must die? I think this little body is done for. It's okay. I'll be alright. Just carry me to the workstation. We can disable that alarm.
That's it. We're safe. Listen, I have something to tell you. I knew the power required to disable the city's central control system would be immense. More than this drone body could handle. With the security now disabled, I can take control of the system and open the, the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. But I made that choice when I hooked into a first computer and the consequences it could bring. I'm sorry we won't see the outside together. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity, to hold on to the past. But I see a future in the companions, and you. Here, let me take that off you. Oh, You are my friend. The very best I could have asked for. Thank you. Damn. Oh. Door opening. Please wait. Oh, okay, I can just continue to sleep here. I guess we'll see what the camera does. A nice wide shot. Yeah. Wow, it just keeps going. Like the the controller's vibrating like crazy too, by the way. <laughs> when will it end? Oh, this might be it. Pretty wide open area. The vibration stopped. My hands are numb and tingly. This looks really nice.
Ooh. Birds. He, he never met his friends back. Wow, they left that so open-ended. <laughs> <laughs> you think so? I mean, the cat solved the city problem and then... Okay, but he didn't get reunited with his other cats. Right. And also there is that little, like staticky like turn on thing like maybe um b12 came back to life or something i guess that's what you're supposed to think you didn't get all the memories no i guess you're Just, right you need to get all the memory for the secret ending <laughs> yeah that that must be uh it overall oh uh, man i this game's really incredible um but. one one <laughs> thing is the um the jumping mechanics like the controls like moving the camera and figuring out like what you can actually jump on is kind of awkward uh. Um, and also it feels a little bit like limited in a sense because like there isn't a jump button instead you just like choose where to jump and then like an animation plays yeah, you, can, you can only use a command prompt yeah you know, prompt. it's it's odd hmm. but like, okay. it would be a very different game if you could just, like, jump at any time and it was more like a platformer. It would yeah. be a very different game. And I don't know if it would necessarily be better. I mean, I guess some people will be confused because, yeah, like, they see the prompt for jumping onto it, but it oh. does, that doesn't necessarily mean it's a uh, <laughs> production baby. <laughs> Yeah, all, all the all the babies and cats and dogs that everybody on the staff owns. Uh, That's some, amazing. Oh, uh, some cats pass away. all. Oh. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, like back to that gameplay. Yeah. Um, just because they see the problem for the uh, to jump on doesn't mean that's the answer again. I can kind of see how some players would be frustrated with that. Yeah. Um, so I think where I stand is, I don't know if I'd want to play it again. Like, I, I don't really particularly want to play it again to see, like, the extra ending that's possibly there. I'd rather just look it up. Mm -hmm. Um, but I also, like, want to show it to my mom and I want to see if Finn interacts with it, you know, and that'll be, I guess, when Switch Deck when I get one of the, or Steam Deck, when I get one of those. Uh. Uh, how'd you feel about watching it? You? Mm hmm Like the animations in the cat. Yeah. I mean, cat, the cat emotion or expression on this game is accurate. As pe any cat lover would tell, yeah. So, the way case, the, the way cat snuggle or mm. reaction right after the cat gets the jacket. <laughs> I 
Ah. But yeah, this was a really magical experience as a cat person. I'm just <laughs> curious how Finn reacted to the cats on the screen. I, I'm also curious. He, he doesn't seem that interested in, like, other cats on TV or anything like that, but what he does take notice of are birds. He loves birds. Typical cat. <laughs> a bird hunters. Yeah. They're predators after all. So. Oh. Okay. So that's it for the stream tonight. Um, Next Saturday, I guess, is our next one. And we will be beginning Disco Elysium. Are you, are you saying this Saturday or next Saturday? Uh, the, the, the next... The, this coming Saturday... The next okay. Saturday that happens. Uh, uh, Saturday from now. Yeah. <laughs> we will be playing. Just to Elysium. Uh, so I thought about running uh, like a poll as to like how I'll play this game because it's incredibly open-ended. But I decided that I would just play what I feel is the most fun. And I kind of just wanted to get like a feel for how you guys feel about this. Uh, good cop or bad cop? Uh, I don't know anything about the game. Bad yeah, cop. Yeah. yeah. Bad cop? So we got a, yeah, we got a good cop already here. So let's play okay. bad cop. Okay, good, good. Um, so what about uh, gremlin cop? What about a cop that can't cannot function without drugs? Uh, I don't like that kind of game, to be honest. Er. Uh let me see. Uh what about a cop who takes advantage of other people's generosity at every turn? Hell yeah. Well I can't do that in I don't do that in real life, so let's do that in a video game. Yeah. Hey, what about your fantasies in games and other media? Yeah, so, um, I, we'll get into it on the actual stream, but my plan right now is to play, um, Inland Empire main, which is basically, like, inanimate objects talk to you. Like, you, you hear the voices of inanimate objects, uh. and they, like, give you clues to the game. So, Inland Empire main stat, uh, druggy cop, uh, superstar hobo communist. Um, yeah, he's he's a communist, so um, you know every everybody you know pays their dues and all that stuff, except for him. Give give all your money to him because he's a superstar. Okay. Hey. Okay. And I haven't determined whether or not we will also be Hobo Cop. Wait, so have you actually beaten this game already, or...? I've played, uh, like, four or five days, I think. In-game in game days, Yeah, in-game in days. Game. Yeah. Um, I, I haven't beaten it. I, I got to a point where I was just like, I want to stream this. Oh, okay. <laughs> and so it's been languishing on the list for about that long. <laughs> but now is my opportunity. We will play Disco Elysium. I'm excited. Or there be Disco Ball. <laughs> um, so I will say uh, all the dialogue is voice acted very well. Um, I don't know if the narration is, so I don't know how important that ends up being. But yeah, I'll probably just do all the narration, but a lot of our, uh, a lot of our own talking will be about like what kind of decisions we make weighing various pros and cons and stuff. I can't wait to be the bad guy because I know I can't do that in real life. Yeah, we're not necessarily going to be the bad guy 
Uh, I kind of feel like Gremlin Route takes kind of a neutral approach. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm choosing to call it Gremlin Route. <laughs> All right. But, yeah. We'll see. Ah. So until next time, I'll see you in the home for infinite losers. See y'all.